my mom wanted me to join because she was saying how like beautiful I am and like other people say it to me but yeah I'll say like thank you and I just kind of move on like I don't see it really I'll put myself out there but when I'm doing it I'm really like insecure about it I think people are judging me so my mom wanted to see if this would help me and it did it had been a while since I'd hung out in a big group of friends and I wanted that again. I haven't been confident in myself at all since I started school in general because I'm always the odd one out. So she thought it would help me and it has. Because I had just moved from South Carolina and I was living in Virginia, we hadn't found a house yet and we were living with my Mimi and J-Paw. The school I went to wasn't really a good school. It was hard to find real good friends there. So my mom wanted me to make friends, so she signed me up for Fearless Spirit Model Crew. I went through bullying, threats, and I was also harassed quite a lot. And that affected my mental health. It, hit, it made me hit my body. And I also had severe bad anxiety. I wanted to join because I wanted to be a role model, I guess. You want to be a role model? Um, well, but also to show people that they're more than they think they are. I did kind of have issues with like self-esteem when it comes to like appearance and always being self-conscious and all that. I saw what Casey did before with other people and I wanted to do that. <laughs> it's hard to pick one. Either the fashion show or just getting to like talk to everyone. Mm -hmm. All the experiences that I got with all the girls. Everything was so fun. Skyla and Nadine just make us laugh all the time. There were these like headbands that we used when we did our kaleidoscope shoot and Elizabeth, Faith and I, we were all messing with them because there were three and so like we'd wear them and mess around. The one I had, I stuck my finger in because it was like those tube things and I couldn't get it out. And so we even had to call like Miss Casey over and we had to cut it a bit in order to get my finger out. And then they were joking me the entire time, saying, don't, don't put your finger in it again. Probably when Casey would cut us out and put us in little scenes. That one just looked really cool because we got to be in like different worlds that we weren't actually in. And the one where we had to make a little diorama and then Miss Casey took a picture of us and cut us out and then put it on there. We did a box one. And while they were setting up the box, originally it was just going to be three sides and there wasn't going to be a ceiling. And But they ended up dropping the back panel and it just went from the box. The box is like really funny of us trying to like cram in there. I mean, I didn't have a problem because I'm short, but other, a lot of them were tall. So they were like just trying to cram and it would like fall down. I feel like I'm more positive about myself and to others. I feel more confident in myself and I feel like I can express myself. I can definitely go into stores a little bit better on my own. I used to be like this. I couldn't hand them the money. I was like, just take it. Just take it from where I'm standing. I used to never be able to like take pictures without a filter and now I mostly never use one. So that's definitely different. I've learned how to make friends in an easier way. It's not that hard or scary anymore. I've had a lot of fun and I'm definitely not going to forget ever. I got to meet a lot of new people and I definitely do kind of see myself in a different way. During the modeling sessions, I was given so many compliments that were so specific and tailored to me. In case you wouldn't mention something about my jaw or my bone structure. To hear those tailored compliments is specific to the person and it doesn't sound like you're just saying it to say it. Um, I think they like seeing the photos of me. <laughs> they were really happy and proud of me. <laughs> they were? Yeah. My mom came to look at the pictures after each session, so that was probably her favorite part. Mm -hmm. My dad um, only saw the fashion show, so I guess his favorite part would be the fashion show. <laughs> <laughs> I think the dresses and seeing everyone and their different personalities. My parents, they really liked probably the video because 
only my mom came along for the individual session. So my dad had never seen like the behind the scenes before. So I think everyone was uh, really liked the video because it was like their first time seeing it. Time that we all walked around together. I like that one. I really like, you know, looking up and seeing the video all put together. Seeing all the videos of everybody, and we were like all back there, you know, it's just, oh, you look so pretty and stuff. You encouraging them before they went on, helping after they came back. Probably getting ready with just all the model crew, with all of them there, it was a really just a bizarre mix of personalities, and it was really fun, and everybody got along. We just had a lot of fun. All the friends I've made in the different sessions with everyone. And Casey, I'll miss Casey in all the dresses. <laughs> and probably all the energy that everyone gives out, all these positive vibes. <laughs> the people that I met, my friends. Everyone, like, I'll miss Casey, I'll miss you, and I'll miss um, all of the girls. Hanging around other girls, like to be goofy and all that. Looking forward to what Miss Casey is gonna do photo shoot wise. Mm. Like it was all fun. Like at the beginning, we would always be quiet, even then eventually we like a warm up and we were just in there doing goofy things. Working with Casey's and Casey and just being able to throw ideas on the table and having her might actually take them was pretty cool. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. It's worth it. I would tell them it's a really good choice. Join. <laughs> um, join because there really is nothing to regret about it. Like, I'm glad I did this. It was really fun and I just think it's amazing. I tell them that they should and it's really fun and worthwhile. You do meet amazing people. You'll feel safe here. It's helped me a lot and I'm proud of myself now. Like I can wear a lot more different clothes that I didn't think I could wear. Like I've thrown out clothes because I couldn't, like I felt insecure in them. So now that's changed a lot. It helps with your self-confidence. It helps with your self-image and you can make a lot of new friends along the way. <laughs> Just do it. Do something new, get out there, look for fun pictures. <laughs> Thank you, Casey, for getting me out of my shell and making me see that I am pretty. <laughs> Thank you. This was a cool experience. Thank you for being here with us and thank you for the amazing memories I've made. I'd like to say thank you. You've helped me with my self-image. You've made me feel a lot better about myself and you helped me make some really good friends. Thank you so much. This was so fun and I really enjoyed this. You guys are amazing and I love you all like you're my sisters. Thank you. And I'm very thankful for how you've helped me feel better about myself and how everyone else feels about their self too. Um, I want to say thank you for this wonderful experience and that I would gladly do it again tell all my friends that are insecure about themselves to come. That they made it more fun than I expected and that they're all beautiful. Thank you for helping me so much. I've told some people that I've done this and they're like, oh, it's so little. But to me, it means like way more than just a tiny bit of pictures because it's helped me so much. Never think yourself as not worthy and don't feel that you can't do something because of what other people say because it's your choice and your decision.